Third annual football camp hosted by Brandon Coleman, Jerome Company. Third. I see we got some. I see we got some nice football players out here today. Where are football players at? We, we, where are football players at? Y'all play? Y'all ready to play today? All right, it's hot out here today, so we want to make sure that we're drinking a lot of water. We got body armor that came out there, help us out. We wanted to give us some free body armor. All right. I'm gonna introduce Brandon Coleman right quick. He's gonna say what's up to y'all. We're gonna get rolling. What's up, fellas? How y'all doing? I'm Brandon yeah, yeah. Coleman, New Orleans Saints wide receiver. Happy to be out here. Uh, graduating class of 2010. Some of the uh, member behind me graduated with me. Jerome, I'm bring Jerome up here. He graduated class of 2009. And I'm going to let him introduce himself. Everybody clap it up for Jerome Coleman. Y'all ready to get started today? Yeah. I'm uh, Frankie J with the Roland Grimes radio show. Could you please explain to me why you're here at the free football camp? And your name, please, start with you. My name is Tracy. I actually found out through Fox 5 Morning News, which I absolutely love. <laughs> you have a son? Or yes, I have an 11-year-old out there. And is he a football player? No, he's here under duress. <laughs> under, you have to explain that, Mom. Under duress? Yes, because I decide where an 11-year-old spends his Saturday. Ah, great. And when I decide we're going to go, we're going to go. Fantastic. <laughs> and it's always not just sitting on the couch oh. with the video games, girlfriend. High five. You get me. You feel you, me. I, feel you, I was yes. raised that way. Thank you. Exactly. We never stayed in the house. Oh, I grew man. up in South Matter of fact, you had to <laughs> beg me to come inside. They, <laughs> my mother, too. There were nine of us. Can you what? imagine her keeping on oh, all no, of us in no, the no, house? No, no, girlfriend. Get out. Get out. Okay. Don't come back till dusk. And this is your friend. Your name's yeah, just met. Young lady. My name is Michelle. Hi, Michelle. Hi. Um, actually, my son texted me while I was at work yesterday and begged and begged me, so I had to, you know, kind of move some some stuff around so we could make it here. Oh wow! But um, I have a son and a daughter here. Okay. I'm right, all about it. So, same with her. So they're not sitting on the couch and playing video games and watching TV. And you D1 basketball or D1 anything. The statistics show that you look out there today, and right now we probably got a little over 100 kids. There may be one kid out here that will make it all the way up. Education is vital, but the reason why you play multi-sport athletics is that it allows your body to use different muscle groups. It formulates different skill sets. Like with the, my sport now that I coach now, lacrosse, you actually develop in on hand-eye coordination a lot because it's a much smaller ball. For a wide-out receiver, that's phenomenal. If I take a ball that's 7, 8 inches in circumference, and now I go to a football that is 12 to 14 inches in circumference, the eyes can focus so much better on that because they're used to focusing in on a small thing. Yeah. Well, actually, I'm part of a nonprofit called Off My Block. Um, it's based out of Washington, D.C. We provide programs and activities for inner city youth um, so they can achieve a sense of confidence, connection, and control over their lives beyond their perception. Lovely. Um, so we've partnered here with Marcus. Um, we're blessed to, for this opportunity to come out here and work with the kids. Off my block, we love the kids. We do anything for the kids. And we're just trying to groom them to be kings and queens that they are called to be. Oh, fantastic. Absolutely. That's why we're here today. Can I show Rest, rest is very important academically and athletically. If you're not, your child is not getting the proper rest, he's not going to be a good uh, student academically or athletically. That's the bottom line. Rest is, is, is more important than working out, doing drills. If they're not getting rest, the proper rest, they're not going to be a good student, period. 